I'm Melissa Rowan, the author of Last Call for Caviar. It's the end of the party. It's your last drink, the last party, the last good times. And obviously people associate caviar with a high life, luxury decadence. The end of times, besides being interesting to everyone, it's a great narrative device. It was a great setting and it moved the plot along and explained certain dilemmas and choices that the heroine Maya J. needed to make. There are parts of it that are spiritual, there's parts of it that are scientific. I'm very fascinated by astronomy, um, science. I was a science nerd when I was in school. I do deal um, a little bit with social commentary because you can't really be talking about this. You've got resource wars going on. You have haves and have-nots, which is an age-old question, and that is the background of this book. I didn't want this to be that the apocalypse was the plot. Um, it's a background. The south of France is a background. I wrote there because I live in the south of France. It's a beautiful place. It's interesting looking at it from the perspective of people who are privileged and are losing their privilege. And, I mean, you really can't beat the south of France for, for fun, for parties. I mean, they do know how to party. Last Call for Caviar, a new novel by Melissa Rowan. Buy your copy today and savor it.